Hello and welcome back to Coffee Talk. It's been a few weeks for me to, since I've played this game last. Um, I have uh, been playing and uploading and editing Remnant a lot lately, so I haven't really had that much time to do this, but I'm back and these probably will be infrequent, um, to be honest, because Remnant takes up so much time and space and Blah, blah, blah. Anyways, let's get back to it. Um, last time we... I think this is her, the demon girl's boyfriend that we were talking to, and... Let's continue. Hi. Sorry to keep you waiting. It's okay. I forgot, I forgot the voices too. I had a nice chat with the fine folks here. Hi there. Hello. Hi, would you like to order something? Huh. Surprise me. What kind of order is that? Well, I don't really know what to order. Do you have any preference, sir? Something bitter to keep me awake with milk. Oh, and draw some latte art. Oh. Draw some. Draw some, man. Uh, my brew pad. Something with milk. That's got milk, milk, or just milk. I, I he didn't specify. Italian delight. Coffee, coffee, and some milk. Brewed up real nice, and we got to do some kind of art on it. Um, I'm not very good at art. Trash it, serve it, latte art. Try to do. Uh, wait, reset. Oh, it's going all wibbly wobbly. I don't know what I'm doing. Just make some kind of design there. I don't know. I'm not good at the arts. Let's see what he thinks. Here's your order. Ha ha ha. Is this what you call latte art? That's cute. I hope it tastes good though. Perfect. That's what's important, not the art. Um, I, we don't know her name yet, I guess. Or was it him? No, this is him. Anyway, I was distracted by some work, plus there's the rain. It's okay, Bailey's. Ah, uh, there's his name, Bailey's. Like the coffee. Drink coffee. Coffee alcohol stuff, I guess. I was having a nice chat with him. Oh, yeah, and plenty of proper to introduce myself. I'm Bailey's. I know. Oh my, where are my manners? I haven't introduced myself either. My name is Lua. Hi, I'm Freya. Nice to meet you both. I'm Smilvin. What an unfortunate name that I have, but I picked it for some reason. Hey, do you ever... Do you know that Freya here is a writer for the Evening Whispers? Oh, really? I've done some work for them a few times. Oh, what kind of work? I'm a freelance designer and illustrator. I've done some characters and infographic for the paper. I assume you were in contact with Steve? Who's Steve? Yep, he's a nice guy to work with. I guess it doesn't really matter who Steve is. Oh, really? Silence. No, he isn't. But I've dealt with worse clients. Way worse. Yeah, I'm glad there's an, he's in the design and visuals department. I wouldn't be able to stand working with him directly. Ha ha ha. Come on. He's tough to deal with, but definitely not the worst. Oh yeah, of course. No matter how deep you go, there's always another layer of hell. That's true. And kind of funny. Not laugh out loud funny, but, you know. How do you usually deal with bad customers here? 
The only bad customers this late at night are the lost drunks and criminals. That sounds pretty bad, yeah. Get those those type in here. Oh, look at people walking past. In the background, there's a cat. Cool. Cat person. That sounds really bad. Nah, they're easy to handle. Really. That's because that's because you're good friend, good with your fist. Not as good as your coffee making skill, but though. Cool. Oh, badass. Sorta. Thank you. I'll take that as a compliment. Yeah, welcome. Anyway, I really need to start writing whatever it is that I'm going to write. So I'll leave you two in the hands of our friendly neighborhood barista. Where were you going to write? Oh, not far. Just over that table in the corner next to the windows. That's my spot. Oh, okay. Have fun. Heh, heh, heh. <laughs> I'll try. <laughs> what an awkward person. And she's a writer. She doesn't seem very good with words. Good luck. Thanks. Should we move to other seats too? My nah, hair is good. Okay. Okay then. So how was your day? It was fine. Work was less than special. I finished my frills early so I could get out of the office. Plus my boss is really good mood all day. Thought your boss was always a happy-go-lucky person. Well, he is. But today was happier than usual. I'm not sure what happened, but it was great seeing him smile so much. What about you? Any problems with your latest client? Yeah, this one's a pain in the ass. You know those me those memes that depict terrible clients? No, I don't. I'm not big on memes. Well, she fits in all the bills. I could go on forever complaining about her, but that won't help me a bit. True. Definitely true. Words to live by. You should make a meme about her. I lose my current project for a minute of laughter? That might be worth it. You should ask Melvin here about how to deal with annoying clients. Yeah, because you guys are annoying. No, not really. Oh yeah, how about uh, how about you usually deal with annoying customers, ones you don't need just to take care of. I do have my own methods, but it wouldn't work. Wouldn't be wise to talk about customers to other client customers. Excuse me. Now that's one good lesson to learn for the day. Um, your phone is going off. Oh, she's smoking. That's an interesting looking cigarette. <laughs> looks like, it looks weird with all the little pixel art. I didn't even notice that. Your parents? Yeah. Nothing to say. So you've got to talk to them. I did. Didn't end well. No. What did they say? A lot. Nothing. 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 That will give us a chance at all. Anyone but an elf. That's what they say. Said. How about you? More or less the same. I'm going to do a fight with my old man. That's so why I'm staying at Farron's place now. Whoa. What happened? It seems unnecessary, this line here. We zoomed in, but... See, half of the sign is on the left side, so we're not really getting, like, more space in here, if that, if that makes sense. They kicked you out. You don't have to do this, you know. They're your family. I can't stand even more second being a part of them. I might have a stable income, but I can't manage. But still, you don't know what they said about you last night. Whoa. I'm sorry. What did they say about me? Or about my race, I assume? Forget it. I want to know. Just the same old shit. 
humbly about how elves are holy creatures, about our immortality, about how they are immortal. That's usually the case, isn't it? So that causes a problem, obviously. And I'm guessing she's not immortal. Oh yeah, it says right there, okay. About how we even outlive you. What? Nothing. About how you live, outlive me? No other elves would want to be with an elf. What? No other elves would want to be with an elf. It's already been tainted by a lowly succubus. Oh, that was, <laughs> okay. I didn't read the whole thing. That's exactly, uh, wrong voice. That's exactly what they said. Doot, doot, doot. So this is it then, the end of our relationship. Doesn't have to be. You know our families would never agree. You got a lot of dead space here. We can just continue like this. What do you mean? They don't need to know what we're still dating. We can just continue the way we've always been without them knowing. And then what? Good point. Do you want to be hiding our relationship for the rest of eternity? We're not like humans, you know? We can't just elope. What? Why not? Why do humans have that privilege only? And you won't get permission because you're too old. What? Lou, I don't care about their permission. I'm glad to sever my family ties if I have to. I can't let you do that. You lose your immortality. If I get to spend my life without you, with you, I don't mind. I don't mind a bit. You're making this hard for both of us. Do you feel happy when you're with me? Of course I do. Then you don't need any more reasons. You know we're perfect for each other. You don't even need to look down deep. Trust me, I'm just, we can do this together. I'm just like observing this conversation the whole time. I'm just standing there looking at them. It's weird. Nothing, nothing. Okay. You can't talk this clearly right now. We'll talk later. Lua, wait. There she goes, Bailey. So you had to listen to our problems. That's what I do. They just like cheers. They come in and talk about the problems. Late at night. That's that. Uh, almost did a voice there. That's all right. This, this coffee shop has seen all kinds of stories. Yeah. See. Do you hope yours will have a happy ending? Uh, I, I hope so too. Do you have any alcohol? Sadly, no. That's a bummer. Well, do you have anything that's warm and can calm me down? Green latte? That calm you? Green latte? Lattes have, or green tea has caffeine in it. Green tea lattes? I'll take one. Back to the old phone thing. Phone menu. Green tea latte. Green tea, milk, milk. I've seen this is green tea. Yes. Milk, milk. Latte art. Do you want latte art? Do something simple here. There we go. It's a little smiley face. This tongue, whoops, that didn't work so well. That's supposed to be his tongue there. Um, invert. That does nothing. Get my little pig nose. Okay, where did I serve it? Here's your green tea latte. You didn't even look at it. I did some art for you. This is good. Thank you for this. By the way, are you married? Me? No. 
Do you have someone they love? I love this coffee shop. Married to your work. I see. I'm sure that's not the answer you're looking for. Eh, I didn't really have any expectations. Man, out of all the people in this world, why did I fall for her? Can't choose who you fall in love with. Sort of can, yeah, I think. You can, but it's hard if you try hard enough. At least, that's what my old man says. He really is one pretentious elf. But I guess all of them are. Titled pretentious to mortal douchebags. At least you have an attorney to learn and change. Yeah, that's a good point. Or an attorney to be an eternal asshole. Well, if you so choose. Anyway, I need to go now and probably drink myself under the, under until the sun rises. There's still a while until the sun rises. More time for me to drink then. See you around. See you around too, Miss Miss Frey. Oh yeah, right. Her. Thank you. Do visit again. Freya. She was listening too. You were listening from the corner? Yeah. Corsos. Hope they find a way to be together. Me too. Anyway, I need to leave. I have to get up early for that usual tomorrow. The, pff, I probably should have read that before. <laughs> Just passed by. Okay. I think I'm going to close up the shop after this. That's pretty early. I know. After the rest of the delivery come in tomorrow, I'll open as usual. Okay, have a good night then. You too. There she goes. Drown your troubles in coffee. Sounds like a good idea. Chocobi Meruku. Sweet, nourishing, healthy chocolate. It's got a little heart in it, that's neat. How sweet. Are we on to the next day? Wednesday, okay. 23rd. Anyways, I'm going to stop there for the evening uh, or whatever time that I end up putting this out. Um, enjoying it. Hope you're enjoying it. Um, so I will continue until I don't enjoy it anymore. Um, maybe you won't enjoy it either. But I mean, I might go through the whole thing. We'll see. I tr I'm trying to really hard to finish my videos lately. To finish this series, that is. Um, so, goodbye for now.